just following the slower track runs parallel almost with the Macmillan track I just spent a bit of time to see if I could see any deer nothing at the moment that I can see I'm normally pretty good at picking them out um, with my eyes without using zoom I use the zoom after I've but the camera's not doing it like it used to it definitely isn't sharp and getting right in there like it used to There's various routes down into the Coombs. That's, um, I think that could be Slaughterhouse Coombe, that one. Yeah, I reckon it is. Or Somerton, it's one of those. I think it, no, I think it's Slaughterhouse. Then you've got Frog's Coombe, that's a nice one. Um, I haven't done that one for a while. That's another day, another trip. You can't do them all on this. This is going to be a big enough hike as it is. It is very tempting to do with lower hair nap. Very tempting. It's just that line that goes across there. It is very tempting to do it. I do like it as well. We've only got to go up a bit higher and then we'll be on the higher one, see? So, that's what I want to do really for the views. So it's the 9th of October 2021. I've got a feeling it's John Lennon's birthday today. He died on the 8th of December but he was born on the... 9th of October, I think that's right. I think that's right. God, he would be, um... God, he'd be 81 now. John Lennon would be 81. <laughs> he died when he was 40. Yeah, he died when he was 40. Just 40. Mm. I remember that. I'll never forget it. <sighs> yeah, it was a, quite a shock. Him being assassinated like that, murdered. It was a terrible thing. I've still got, um, I went out and bought his album that he just released. And um, watching the wheels go around, one of I can't remember exactly what it's called now. I can, but it's not coming to me. But um, yeah, that was a, a big, big event, really, because the Beatles have been in our lives since, well, since I was a kid, and you know, it was a bit of a shock. Anyway, this is you, John Lennon. I'm out in this beautiful countryside, mate. Enjoying. I've seen some bikers. I've seen two walkers so far, and that's all. I've seen nobody else. My eyes aren't as sharp, so I can't quite pick out the deer at the moment. But they're probably being hunted. Not today, but they get hunted. And uh, they hide in the woods. I can remember the day I hunt. The master of the hunt went by. He had his whip and he had a, a pistol. A pistol in, on his um, saddle to shoot the deer if necessary. Yeah, I remember that. I had to get out of the way. I think the hunt would have run me over. I was only out walking and I took pictures of it all. <laughs> I put them all over YouTube. Yeah, I came up here a few times when the hunt was on. And not to come to watch it, I don't like it. I went on one myself when I was about 16 or 17 on Dartmoor. Because I used to help out in the stables. 
and they said I could go on the hunt. I was only young then. I'm glad I never went on another one, and I'm glad the fox got away. That was a fox hunt. I was on a horse for eight hours. Oh, God, that was hard. Do you know what? It's baking hot. I didn't bring a hat. I'll be glad when I get down there in the coombs a bit later. I didn't bring a hat. I got my suntan notion though, my protector I mean. Why are we going to meet up with the Macmillan Way again in a minute? It's just up there. Right over now, there's the Hulls Road post. Lots of mist now. Made the camera go a bit funny. Um, I'm now heading, there's the Dalesborough Hill Fort, we're not going there, we're going up a track along the, over there in a minute, along that ridge there. That's Higher Hair Nap. That's what I'm heading for, it's my afternoon walk. More people coming out now, quite a few more people actually. Um, which is fine. I'm expecting it. I mean, I'm glad I did that Paradise Coombe when there weren't no one about. I've got a feeling I've got to get turn off and see. I never know. I might end up on the lower hair nap by mistake if I ain't careful. Might do. Yeah, I've been, yeah, because basically I've been on the track down that way before now. I've come off here, and this is where you can find a lot of deer. And I've gone down there. Yeah. I've got a feeling, I, I, I've got to be careful, I'll end up on the, um, the lower hair nap because I've, I've actually forgotten. Yeah, that's Somerton Coombe there, you see. That's Somerton Coombe. And, um, I think when I'm doing the lower hair nap, I go up that coombe. I think I do. That's, it was down on that track where the hunt passed me and there was hunts people all around and there were people in cars watching. I need to be on the top one. That's the lower hair nap, I'm sure of it. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, that's, that is Somerton Coombe down there. It's a beautiful coombe. It's got a lovely track. It's very peaceful. Very pretty. And I can see somebody walking lower nap. I'll just uh, home in a minute. I've seen them. There we are, yeah. Two people doing lower hair nap. It ain't the higher one, because the higher one's higher. <laughs> yeah. It's all making sense now. But of course I could say to myself, well, why don't you just do lower hair nap, Sheila? Why don't you just do lower hair nap? This is your chance to do it. If you want, if you don't, if you want to stop now, I don't know if I can join Higher Hair Nap if I went over there. Let me have a look. Is that a join there? There's the road. I don't know. It looks a bit dodgy, doesn't it, through the bracken? 
We haven't really got to go much further, only up on the top there, and we'll be on the high one. Now we'll go up to the hill. We've come, we said we're going to do higher hair nap. We'll do lower hair nap another time. Higher hair nap's got to be done. Right, over and out.